Jackpot. Plural. Here are the figures. Here are the facts. This is the first time in the history of the Connecticut Lottery where both Mega Millions and Powerball's jackpots have both been over $300 million at the same time. I pay off all my debt and then I take a long vacation across Europe with all my family and have a great time. The Connecticut Lottery is doing a brisk business this week. And why? There you go. The power of two. Powerball and Mega Millions. Tonight we have the Mega Millions jackpot that's $346 million and tomorrow is Powerball $307 million. Combined that's more than $650 million. Sure for you to win lightning has a better chance of striking twice but just imagine where the tickets could take you or you could literally own a boatload of Bugatti. More than 250 of them. And these jackpots aren't lost on lawmakers like Representative Tony Guerrera from Rocky Hill. With a looming budget gap of around $2.3 billion in the year ahead, he joked that winning money like this would put a dent in the deficit. Obviously, that's a huge number. I think the state of Connecticut should buy some, some tickets when we're talking $650 million. That would be a nice thing to do. Buy 100 tickets, take it out of there, and you never know what could happen. No doubt this will be the ticket to end someone's troubles. The additional revenue it generates that goes to the general fund is, is a big bonus. And really, it's more excitement and more fun for our players, and that's what we want. So remember, the Mega Millions drawing is tonight. Powerball Wednesday night. Both drawings on our sister station, WCCT-TV. Reporting at Lottery Headquarters in Rocky Hill, Jim Altman, Fox 61 News.